Welcome, 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 welcome. Yeah, baby, we back. Episode twenty-two, and we back. Congrats to our winners. Oh yeah, yeah, last, congrats. Last winners. Hope I think uh, Richard took their shit already. Yeah, nah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They should have it. Okay, so congrats, guys, and twenty-two. No, Adam. Twenty-two. No, Adam. Yeah. You got canceled or what? No, I'm saying twenty-two. No, because it's episode it's twenty-two. This is not. I know twenty-two. <laughs> this is episode twenty-two of Talking Tipsy. <laughs> There you go, hold up, hold up. He's gonna make a connection. He's gonna make a connection. You think they picked that up? Yeah. Yeah. How's your All right, So thing? what you got, Worm? Where you uh, bought drinks today, so what the fuck is that? Serb uh, Serbian succulent oh. sipper, Indian pill, Irish spring. Fuck you spinning and I can't even read it. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. Indian pale ale with melon, melon and peach. peach. Damn, Bye. that that sounds gas. Serb Ray, which one do you want? Yeah. I'll Give take either the uh, Yabba Dabba or the Deep. Give him the chubby unicorn. The Deep? That's an IPA. I don't know. Has you from, from the boys? <laughs> Wait, uh, which one's the IPA? This one. Uh, the, the one chubby that unicorn. Worm has over there. Well, I don't think that's an IPA. Actually. Both of these are IPAs. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Then there you go. This is like, this like is the Indian one we had last, oh, last That's an IPA, big dog. The slushy. It's a sour? Yeah. Smoothie style sour L, yeah. What's the other one? This one's IPA. And what's that Deep? The deep is a IPA. Oh no no, it's a sour. It's a bottle logic. It's from Bottle Logic. Uh, tart L brewed with coconut, pineapple, and orange. All right. So no disrespect. I'm gonna skip out on these. I'll have a little swig. He forgot about you. That's what but, it was. But but last Dude, episode. It's so hard to get stuff for him. Well, all you all, like is seltzers, huh? All I like is plain cheese. You should have oh got me a plain gosh. cheeseburger, dude. Damn. You know what? That shit sounds good. Dude, as a plain cheeseburger <laughs> slaps. I mean, you never had just a every burger now and with then. Cheese, every bro. now and then, sometimes you just gotta go like off the roster. You know you, you have, bro. You made some basic a plain hell yeah. sliders or what? yeah. <laughs> What's bro? wrong with the plain yeah. cheeseburger? It's pretty good. Not nah, cool, because look, so like I'm always looking at people like when I go to lunch with like my homies like from work and stuff, and I'm always like, oh, what do you want? Oh, can I get a bacon cheeseburger plain, nothing else? Like I just want bacon and cheese and the burger, yep. like nothing else. And I'm like. You're weird, but every now and then I I get that and it slaps. I think if you have bacon, you need some lettuce because I feel like it's too much. Not mm. good. Try it. Too much what? Too much like bacon without vegetables. Nah, the only reason why I want to skip out because I didn't mind the drink uh, last episode. It was good. But uh, I want to say this is a uh, that was an excuse for my poor shitty attitude on the podcast. Because I was drinking beer. I don't like beer. It's not a beer. It's a sour. Same shit. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> it is no. a beer. You said you have a sweet. I'm going to start acting all fucking bitchy and moody. Watch. <laughs> Check this out. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Distraction. <laughs> no, this is all right. Uh, and it needs to be colder for sure, though. Definitely. Colder? I mean, I got them out of the freezer. Well, not nah, the freezer. this will this put them in the same bag as the hamburger the to warm it up. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. That one's pretty good. I was thirsty. Uh, try that. Taste that. I want to say something. That, like this glizzy one, it looked hilarious. I was going to get that one. What but it was fuck? a double. It was a hot dog mm. flavor? Probably. <laughs> Wait, I think uh, in our first episodes at Richard's house, I think I bought one of this. I think you drank it. Warm. That one? It looks nah, super familiar. Nah, I never drink no chubby bunny unicorn thingy. You bought one of this? I bought one of this, bought this one. Of this. <laughs> yeah, fucking um Fuck, dude. I was gonna tell you guys something. Tell me. Oh. Tell us. Oh, mean. Fuck. <laughs> the Raiders are losing to the Cowboys, but I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I thought oh, it doesn't oh. matter right now. What uh, exactly, dude? And it's so funny, bro. It, it Everyone's hyping every team. Up, but it's like, up, bro. Because no matter where it goes, if you guys would have won, you guys would have been talking masa. It is what it is. It's bro, just a, it's a game. I hate though. when people say that shit. Because I would not be talking shit at all. They're, I just said we won. That's it. To me, it's like you know how many how many players aren't gonna make it because they're like you scrams, right? The, bro, like, they're still practicing. Yeah. There's, there's only the there, practice there's squad. Only, there's only three. 
percent of those players that are going to stay on. None of those players you know? playing are going to make it to the official team. We're talking about football guys, so you guys don't know. Worm was over here with checking Pretty scores good. and shit. Yeah. Yeah, I just want to see how we're doing, like you know, preseason because it's a. Yeah, but it's a kind of like a intro. Well, look, but, so it, but it doesn't really compare to the actual. It season. doesn't compare, but you get like an insight on who the bench players when your team who's, gets hurt. Who's you're gonna up get. and coming? Yeah, and then like when your team gets hurt. Okay, then, that's cool, I, but I because I, well, I, I play all, I play know. fantasy, so <laughs> so I watch pre I watch preseason because I play fantasy. So when players like big players get hurt, I know who's gonna take their spot and who I need to pick up because they're gonna be the number one. Uh, Russia or whatever, yeah, yeah. you know? Type well, thing. that's fine and everything, but people... Well, you don't watch football. People are... are the fuck? <laughs> I've been watching football. What do you anyways, believe? What do you believe? Black and silver, homie. That's right. But anyways, it's like, it's cool, like, for what you said, you know, the fantasy league and all that bullshit, but people are just like, fuck, yeah, we won! And it's like... Nah, I seen a video, too, today of, like, some uncle that was at a 49er house... And he was like recording everybody. You know how like old people when yeah. anything's going on, they're like recording like this, for like they can't see, <clears throat> bro. And it was like hilarious because he was like, ah, and I'm like, I get it. We won. We're winning. You know, it's it's cool why the game's going on. Yeah, yeah. But anything after that, I thought like it, it's not a real game. It doesn't yeah. count for anything. Yeah, just don't go after be like talking shit. It's like, bro. Yeah, no, I was thinking about it too. If I was a player and I'm making that much fucking money, you think I'm gonna go play a game that doesn't count? Fuck no, dude! I'm yeah. not gonna go out there and wait. So risk an injury. Yeah, risk injury. So or, all the all the big dogs up there aren't playing right now, no, huh? They're fuck just no. chilling, dude. They're they make, just practicing. What if they get hurt? That's true. Damn. I think they play like the first set of downs and yeah, they'll then play that, like then, one yeah. drive, one fucking drive, if and that, then they're like, "I'm good." If that, and that's like, well, that's good for the pre- rookies. Pre preseason game number one, they will. The other ones, it's kind of like eh. Should we? Should we not? Mm-hmm. They'll throw the ball like once or twice or something. I mean, that goes for any sport, right? Yeah, I never, honestly, good. I never understood that, dude. Sports? Like, yeah, sports. For real? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> you never understood what? Nah, just the fact that, that okay, you have these pregames or whatever, but they don't fucking count. That's, yeah. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Well, it's, 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 just, it's just for money. You know what a pregame is for? And for it's for the participation trophies, <laughs> for the people. Oh who are God, well, no, it's it's to it, it's to like showcase like like the rookies, right? Yeah, yeah it's so, to like showcase them. Like, okay, yeah, this is this is their yeah. potential or what? Well, they were, or they have potential, and also to make some some bread on the side. Well, they like were just talking about and all that? Uh, yeah, Spon- so sponsors, so stadiums, the, the, uh, preseason game today, Dallas, <clears throat> uh, their quarterback the that he's playing during preseason, he's gonna get cut. And they are, everybody oh, knows shit. that. He's gonna get so cut? he's going to get cut because he's not going to go against Prescott. Damn. They're going to pick Dak every day. You know, I, you know who they got, right? Huh? You know who they got, right? Who? Trey Lance. Oh, did you know that? Oh, did you know, you know that? What? I, I didn't realize that. Damn. Really nope, Trey nope. Lance is their, their number two now. Who's yeah. So now that Trey he's Lance? the number, well, so so that's <laughs> the part I missed because when I turned it on, they were talking about like they got two quarterbacks already, and it's time to. It's time for him to showcase what he got because there's 31 other different teams. Trey Lance. That, you know, or whatever, you know. Yeah. Trey so Lance he, is coming So from the he's Niners. trying to, today, he's trying to show off, like, hey, I'm going to throw bombs. I'm going to, like, show them what I'm made of so some other team could pick him up and hopefully he can play. Yeah. I was seeing some you shit. You can make it to the league all you want. I was, I'll, 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 I was seeing some shit about these who's uh, uh, talking about Tom Brady going to the Raiders. And I was like, everyone, what? dude, there's so they many he was rumors go about that. Yeah, there's too. so many rumors about that guy. Would you be happy if Tom Brady nah, went to the Niners? He's too old. He's, 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 he's kind of done, him. right? Yeah, he's done. I don't like. Want he's him. he's a legend and all that, but he's break his hip. He's just <laughs> not hanging up, hey, right? Unless the yeah, tuck yeah. move came in in every game situation. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, I don't want him. But what if he's on some like lesser, weaker team, and he's just mo- and they're just beasting because of him? Like the Buccaneers. Could you be kind of like, fuck. <laughs> like the Buccaneers? Yeah. <laughs> Could you be like, fuck, he should have came to all us. of a sudden. The Bucks are, yeah, maybe. Everybody was a Bucks fan all of a sudden. I just don't think he fits our play style. I think he should just just, just hang it up, bro. Just die. No, oh, not die. Oh, <laughs> my, my fault. My fault. <laughs> speaking <laughs> of sports, and sp- not sp- speaking you know? about fools that are retiring, did you guys see uh, Blueface and uh, Mayweather spar? Oh, yeah. I saw a little clip of it. You see it? 
No, I didn't. Sick ass. <laughs> okay, yeah. but anyways, okay. When it comes to boxing, whatever. Dude, I'm starting to think like it's just rigged. Anyone could fucking just go. Like any known name, I'd say, is just going up there. Okay. Yeah, well, but they could start. Was, like, uh, but do you think nah. they really have talent? Okay, for example, what's his name? Jake Paul. You I mean, know his name. You know his where name. He, where he's coming from. <laughs> well, that's there's, what I'm saying, well, there's though. two of them. There's two Pauls. That's why it gets mixed up. <laughs> where he's coming from, you know how he started. Whatever he's his just fucking an his rep. In his name. His name was big, so he was able to. I mean, yeah, that's the way I I fucking see it. I mean, okay, but do you think he's talented? Do you think he's an actual boxer, mm. or do you think he's just making content because of his fucking? I think name? he's just making content just because of his name. To and me, I think that shit is rigged for sure. I think mm-hmm. now now I, it's more rigged than yeah. I'm pretty well, sure back then the shit was rigged. Whole, like debacle about like oh if you win you get like shitted out of a lot of money yeah. and this contract is broken and this yeah. this and that or whatever burn bridges but to me bro imagine being a fighter like a real fucking fighter who built who from built, the ground up yeah who built their fucking name to say Reputation. like bro i'm a champion i took out some of the best oh but you know what i'm gonna lose to this fucking white kid just because so he's gonna, I wouldn't just, even sign just, the contract. just because he's gonna give me the bag yeah, yeah, I'll give up everything I fucking work for, make him look good, and then I'll just get my money. I think that's what happened with, I think, Canelo. Well, everybody has a they, price. They asked him to fight like a, like a celebrity, and he's like, I'm not, he's like, I'm not doing that shit. It's like, that's, yeah, like, that yeah. hurts your, like, your, everybody, your, like, legacy. Everybody has their price, you know? Yeah, nah. Well, fuck like, that. well, a lot of people have their price, but, like, so even in, like, big sports, so I believe there's, uh, like, a soccer team in, like, Dubai. That mm-hmm. they have like their own soccer team, and then they offered Messi a shit ton, like a like I think a bill or something. No, like they offered that. Cristiano. Oh, I thought they offered Messi too, and Messi turned it down. Oh yeah, Messi Me- turned it down. He's Messi in, uh, turned it down. He's Messi, Miami. Messi, Messi got uh, just on his leg from his knee down. He has a con like if he breaks it or anything, he gets paid out. Type really? Thing. Yeah. Let's go oh, but it's leg. like so he didn't have a price because he's like, well, why would I do? It? I was like, me. I would not turn down a Billy. I'm sorry. I don't care who I am. So that's your price. It, yeah, but I mean, he worked. I, I can't, <laughs> but I can't, I can't like say nothing for him because he worked his way up there. If it was something that I worked my way for, I don't know. I might feel different at that point in time. But <clears throat> as of right now, all right, let me, I, let me I, put it like I'd this be then. stupid to turn down a Billy. All right. If I said, Worm, can I cut off your both arms, but I'll give you a billion. Would you do it? What would I, how would I pay? How with would your, I, with how, your two arms? How would I what? use my How would I use my money if I have no arms? Get fake arms. <laughs> you got a billion dollars, no? Can you you cut off one feet? arm for sure. <laughs> you cut off one arm for sure. All right. Anyways, back I to said two. <laughs> back to Blueface. You guys, an answer? What do you guys think? Trash. Think I think so. so. I mean, to I be think, honest, I didn't see it, but I think. Like, then what the fuck? I kind of already see the outcome. I think he got like good squabbles. I think I think he got you think better. He can squabble. He got better I, for sure. I think he got hood squabbles. Okay, but to fight Boxing. Mayweather, mm-hmm. no, well, he was no. sparring with them. He's, He's sparring with Mayweather. It, yeah, Mayweather knock him out of like. I think if he did a celebrity round, fight too, sure. Blueface, I don't see him winning. Well, he already has, and he won. Who did he, who did he win? Some uh, some fucking TikTok dude. That's crazy, That's dude. Oh, Who is it? Salt Poppy? It's like a street fighter. Dude, dude. Salt Poppy. Don't, yeah. That guy's got hands, bro. That one got hands, That's bro. the one, dude. Who I think. Why? Because you 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 seen like the videos of him training and him going. He didn't start. All oh, the, way the, at the dude top. that that runs in place. Yeah. yeah. Have you seen yeah, him, bro? But he, he, got he didn't skin, start. Bro. But he didn't start all the way like straight at the top. He started, started at bottom. like a a bottom card, but his name was known, so it became something to watch, dude. You know? Yeah. Like, I seen and videos of him up. training, and I'm like, damn, this would change a lot. Naturally, like, though, like he's got fucking hands, dude. Like he's got the best technique. Like technique? The, his whole style and stuff. I'm like, oh shit! Like he knows what he's doing. He can he is, can squabble. Is the salt guy, the one that fucking no, goes no, like, the one that fucking thing. like salt poppy, oh. the one that fucking runs in place, <laughs> the one that goes like this, the one who does the the hands and all he gets that, the salt and, thing. and then he just runs in place. Oh, okay. The, the, I know. I know. He what you're was talking chubby, about the okay, Asian yeah, 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 yeah. dude. He's like a Filipino. Yeah, Filipino. <laughs> he is, he is Filipino. Filipino. Yeah, I was like yeah. the salt dude. The one that <laughs> no, he, he, he got skinny though. He's, like he got. Okay, I know. He's, he's training and shit. But yeah. Anyways, back to Blueface again. Fucking. Uh, he was. He was. He has a. He has a, 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 a upcoming fight. 
But he got fucking stabbed in the leg in the fucking. Who stabbed the, him? This some, girl. Some random. Yeah. Right. Uh, <laughs> <girl>. <laughs> Did you guys see the video? But they're crazy. <laughs> I guess. Nah. I guess he was a. Uh, he was like like fucking. He was like I think he just finished like practicing, and, and some dude came in. And then they were talking shit, and in the video, he just fucking, he's, he just starts swinging on him, and then the dude fucking pulls out a knife, and he fucking stabs him in the leg. And then... You, you can never go down with a good bra anymore. Well, he fucking, well, he hit him a few times. <laughs> but either, what were you going to do? Is either you get somebody? stabbed or, or get shot at that point. But after seeing how, how he punched him, I, I don't think Blueface has that. Because you know how, how people have like a, like a good knockout in them? Mm-hmm. Uh, you don't think he has he that does. power? He, he punched him like twice in the face, and the dude didn't drop. He punches like this? No, he, he <laughs> no he, he he had the gloves and everything. You see those people are like, <laughs> nah. He had the like he he just finished training. He had the gloves, and then the dude came in, and Blue was just boom, 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 and and the dude fucking pulled the knife out, and I was like, damn, I was like, that fool, that fool did not come out. Those punches should have did something. Nah, but you're saying he has gloves on, so I don't. know But it doesn't have that. It, yeah, he, he just doesn't still have that hip power. Still you know? knocked him out. It's just everybody got that hit power, so yeah. he just doesn't have that. Eventually, he'll knock somebody out. Enough hits, of course, you're going to get knocked out, but if he doesn't have that raw power to do like a one-hitter quitter type thing. Yeah, but it's it's kind of sad how boxing is turning into like 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 all like well, celebrities now. Everybody has their signature, bro. Cause so like every like so Jake Paul, he was like a content creator for funny you know like he was doing like the vines and all that everybody has like their own thing matter of fact if you were to have your own signature your own staple when somebody says like hey diego what are you known for or like what do people like envision when they hear your name what would you say for me or diego diego Diego? we'll go go that way that way having a big old (laughs) bowl yeah (laughs) i don't know honestly I'll, I, I feel like I can't look outside and like look and think about shit. I I don't know. But so even, what you're saying is, yourself, what you do we think? think? Yeah, I don't know. Cause, Cause it's like, for me, everything's regular, but for, for you or for you, you're like, oh, he does this. He says this. He wears this. It's just like, I don't, I don't know. That's just but regular, you, regular. You, don't, you don't have something like first in person mind? point of view? In mind? Not even for yourself? No. Oh, you sound like Richard right now. Do you have, like, a tendency (laughs) that you always do? No, yeah, you're right. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, my God. (laughs) All right. I guess. Gabe, Gabe, if I were to say Diego's coming, what would you envision? Like, when you you, you hear the name Diego, like, what do you? I guess my. Well, I don't want to hear what you envision. (laughs) (laughs) Instantly bricked up, bro. Instantly. I guess it would be my, like, uh, my sarcasticness. Is that is that is yeah, that kind of accurate? Yeah, I mean, you you are accurate because I was because when I first met um, the homegirl, uh, Alondra, like I'll say some dumb shit and I'll, I'll be like a straight face, and she'll start laughing like, "Bro, I don't know if you're fucking serious or not," <laughs> and I'm like, "I'm not," <laughs> but no, it's like I'm, I'm I'm making a joke, but it's like I'm so serious, and they're like, "What? Like what the fuck?" <laughs> but when it's I like, first when I first met you, I had to get acquainted to that too. See. Like I, I had to look at you, and then you'd be like. And then I'll just smile or like I'll, 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 I'll like laugh like later. Yeah. But yeah, I think that I guess my my sarcasm. Like two hours later. My orgasm. That was I'll, funny, folks. I, I was kidding. <laughs> two hours later. Two yeah, hours later. Just know that that joke I told you six hours ago was a joke, bro. <laughs> <laughs> see, I I don't know, maybe because I've known you for so long. Mm-hmm. I don't see fucking sarcasm at all. I know right away when he's kidding or saying something. Well, now I do. Yeah. <laughs> It's now like, I do, but you know, like when I first met him, it was different. I guess. Yeah, every time I fucking tell him something, he just looks at me. He's like, he's like, he just, he just gives that look, and I'm like, fuck, I can't, I can't, I can't do it too. Well. Gabe's that one person to give you a look, like when you're like when you look when stupid. You, yeah, when you <laughs> he'll, look, stupid, he'll look at you, or when you're like you're fucking around, or you're saying a lie or something. He's just, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> he just gives you, yeah, like that whole dog story. He was like. <laughs> and he, and he didn't stop me. On and he didn't stop me once, bro. That's I thought you were joking. I thought you were being sarcastic. So, hey, so, See, I was you letting let you run fail. with your signature, bro. Uh, <laughs> so, sometimes you gotta let people fail. Sometimes. What's your signature, Gabriel? I don't oh, drink beer. Damn. From the outside looking in. From the outside. Well, looking from, in? from the inside looking out, I guess. Fuck. Oh, Gabriel's and then, coming. And then we'll tell you what we think. 
Care Bros call me. We, we have to buy something other than beer. <laughs> oh Damn, dude. I do feel like I'm difficult. I feel like I'm a... I mean, I, mean, I didn't I'm, know I'm what an, the fuck to get you. I was like, I'm a, a, I'm a acquired taste. taste. Yeah, definitely. I'm a very, like... I I real, uh, uh, like, like, real quick, um, side note. If you ever... If you ever got money and you're balling, do you think you'll turn bougie? Yes. Hell yeah. Yeah, fuck yeah. I, <laughs> I feel like you would turn bougie. What do you mean? Wouldn't anyone? I, I feel like I, to an extent, yeah, but you like. You turn like. I feel like you'd be like high powered, like. You turn Bugatti bougie. I, I feel like you like. Hell yeah, I'd slap l- these fucking IPAs out of your guys' hand. I'm like, what the fuck? Dude? Like, you wouldn't drink like fucking. You're only drinking like mineral water. Like yeah. everything he brings is like straight from France. <laughs> so everything's imported. Oh everything's God. imported. Why the fuck not? If I got <laughs> it like that, bro. But yeah, your signature. That that was yeah, it. Just I mean, that I do feel like I'm. You're an acquired taste. I'm an acquired taste. You're difficult. Yeah, you can't yeah, be difficult. Well, when I think of Gabriel, I'm like, he makes up his mind, and if you don't want to go along with it, he'll just switch real quick. Oh, and so it, you, it, it, it's just so it, it is it what it, no no like he'll he'll just be like all right like and then that's it it's just like hey who's down to go snowboarding right and then be like oh well I'm not down or whatever all right well fuck you next uh and then he just <laughs> wouldn't give a fuck about you like he just switches real quick or like hey he's he's not gonna poke you to he's to like, yeah but he's like he's not gonna like try to convince you yeah. Like you say he, no to no, yeah, that's it. he just doesn't give a fuck about uh, what you feel. He's gonna do what he wants to do, kind of thing. Not necessarily switch up, but he's like, "All right, well, cool, fuck you then." Uh, next, who's on? That's fucked up. Yeah, I'm an asshole. <laughs> yeah, well, it, it's not like being an asshole. It's just you're not gonna beg nobody to hang out with you. You're not gonna beg nobody to be around you if they don't want to be around. Exactly, you. I'm gonna acquire like, taste. I yeah. want them to to acquire your taste to swish me around in their palate and be like, hmm. Uh, oh, mm. what's this? Mm. <laughs> what is that? Wait. Yep. Depressed. <laughs> <laughs> With a little, little bit of salt. A little bit of salt yeah, in there. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh, man. Is this Mrs. Dash? Uh, <laughs> there's, um, there's some mecos in there. <laughs> some jizzy. Damn. Some jizziness. You taste it or what? <laughs> Ray's, like, Ray's like, yep. I taste Tastes like shit, pennies. Bro. Tastes like pennies. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I have like a high. What about you, Ray? You guys are foul. I feel like I'm low. Um, like as far as like me? Yeah, just well, yeah. What, what you think. <laughs> like, oh shit, there's Ray. I feel like my shit was peak. I don't know. I feel like we had this combo. No, like, what do you think about yourself or whatever on how you are? No, what do you think is your like staple, your signature? Your signature. Like, but what? you personally, we'll tell you what we think about you. Yeah. We don't <clears> have an issue doing that, but what do you think about yourself? I feel like I'm a huge giver. That's me. Oh, <laughs> I, I don't no. want it. <laughs> Keep it to yourself. Nah, bro. I mean uh, extreme sausage. Extreme <laughs> sausage. <laughs> nah, lately I don't know. That's how I've always been. You know, I mean, for me, I've always been like, I guess, nice or too nice, I should say. And I've always hated hated that about myself. But you couldn't change it. That's you. Who? You no, are. no. Yeah, I get it. But I don't know. Eventually, I feel like that evolved into something. I guess better or more great. I don't know. I don't. I don't like being too nice. You know, there's always got to be like that backbone. You know, that when line. like certain that situations. Line, yeah. But Just, I don't know. For me, um, yeah, I feel like I'm not my giver, dude. Like I'll fucking you know whatever when it comes to parties and shit like that. Like I'll fucking I would want to pitch in. You know, like here, let me handle this. Blah blah blah, and I'll I got it covered. Don't worry about it. So when we say Ray, you think that we're thinking a. Eh, Oh, this was gonna bring something, or this? No, was that's how I say, see myself. Oh, uh, okay, okay. I feel like you guys are gonna say, "Yeah, he's always on the lookout, fucking <laughs> edgy, <laughs> fucking somebody just gonna come in with AKs and just <laughs> blast us to pieces." But I mean, what joggers is he wearing today? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I mean the way that's how I see myself. You know, I don't know. Mine Obviously, like how everyone sees them, how they see me or whatever. Or am I just tripping? Mm. Nah, for the most part. I know you're always down. Like Whenever I hit you up, you always come through. My burp? Yeah. Yeah. My burp? Yeah. yeah. Uh, certain things. Certain things. Like, I, I can't ask you to wake up in the morning. That's the one thing I can't ask you to do. I've been awake. You're capping, bro. How many <laughs> times were we supposed to go fuck? snowboarding, bro? You did it to me like twice nah, or three the times. Thing, the thing that fucking, that like discouraged me is because I didn't have any of my fucking gear, dude. 
So what? Rent it. Oh, uh, nah. Yeah. You were still in the process Everyone, of perfecting and learning a little bit more. Yeah, I feel like once you're, like, barely going, like, it doesn't make sense spending, like, fucking $1,000 on your setup. You're not going to tell the difference between yeah. the gear if you don't know the basics anyways. That's why, you that's why, you know, that's why I <laughs> fucking, like, that's why I, I rented my shit. Because I feel like if I bought it, I would have, like, that next weekend I would have been like, fuck, this was a waste of money. Yeah, Bro, okay. we could have just I, fucking, at that time. I should have just fucking uh, <clears throat> rented gear, then been able to switch. Dude, honestly, you, you should have just took Richard's fucking pass, dude. <laughs> Probably. You should have just took his pass and get a run in real quick. Just one, huh? But whatever. But, well, I'm a size twelve, so I don't think like I would just have to oh. rent. I'd, uh, if I rented boots, I'm kind of your build anyway, so I probably would have been able to ride. What does that mean? Like the stance. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> the stance of the angle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so where, what's your signature? Mm, I think we I all feel know like your signature. Loud as fuck. Well, loud and then a very uh, friendly, inviting homie. I guess I don't know. I just I I feel so personally. I feel like when people talk to me, a lot of times like people open up just because they feel comfortable. Yeah, it's just you're like, comforting. Yeah, co- co- comforting vibe. But I'm loud as well, as well as inviting. obnoxious sometimes. You're very inviting. Yeah, inv- inviting. Damn, I better never meet a vampire because I'm going to die. Come on in, big dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What do you guys think about our, our friend, Big We've one? already said this. I mean, yeah. Pussy? I mean, you're pretty. Yeah. yeah. Huh? You know when I was telling you? Dude, I was, I was uh, trying to win this trip to Vegas for this weekend. And there was this one category. All right. Like, I guess they were putting their own fucking, their own team for Vegas, you know? Oh, you got like. They, everyone fit, like, in each category, right? Whatever. And there was one category, was like, oh, who do you think would be your plus one? Like, like how, how they say it? And it's like, how would you, Play what me. makes it exciting to have that plus one, whatever, blah, 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 blah. And immediately I thought, like, fuck, Worm, let me hit up Worm, you know? And I was like, dude, I feel like I'll fucking win this just based on this category, bro. And we could fucking go to Vegas, you know? This motherfucker but. parties. This motherfucker goes <laughs> yeah. and does everything, bro. Parties. Parties with bitches. Parties and gambles. Parties with guys. <laughs> Sucks. A mean dick. <laughs> <laughs> From the bottom to the top. Uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I didn't win. Well, obviously, Boy, you're, hey, you're still here. Hey, so. If we would have to go in person... And then everybody had to give their little speech. I thought, I think we would have got it. <laughs> sure. I feel like there'd be a bunch of weirdos going like, uh, should it, can I just get the passes, please? Yeah, to probably. Vegas. I want to get away from my abusive relationship. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay, bro? No, I get beat. I get beat by life, bro. Damn, I feel like. I, I went to work today, and they're like, oh, you're not wearing your your shoes that you should be wearing. And I'm like. Okay. The fuck and then they're like, me? well, you we, we told you a while to go buy shoes. I was like, I got a car. I, this is my second job. I got this to pay bills, not to buy shit to work here. What the fuck? Like, what do the fuck I look like? Buying fucking shoes just to go to work. I should have told them. But like, are That's you guys me. paying for them? <laughs> <laughs> well, you, you know, like you get paid. Also paid good, though. But you get paid like that, you know? Fuck no, I bought. <laughs> yeah, but you get You're paid. You're supposed to get like reimbursed. That. You know that, right? For this month, yeah, I was like, I, I, was like, I, I bought was them like last month, so they they didn't accept it. They can't buy some now and then have those as extras. They're free. That's true. But yeah, I'll jump on that. Pause. Buy some, Pause. go get it, go get the money and return. Go them. get the money and then return them. Yeah, you could always do that. And then you have your ones from last month. They still look new, no? Just kidding, guys. We're not gonna do that. <laughs> yeah. If anyone from work is watching, we're not doing that hey, shit, bro. That brings up something I actually did want to talk about. Did you guys hear about like that whole the motherfuckers in the finance? That department? whole returning like returning items to stores and whatnot. Well, how that's about it. how that's fucking changing. That's like, ending now. Yeah, no, kinda. Like, nah, they're starting to crack down on people and actually fucking post images at the stores. Like, hey, this guy fucking does this a lot. And it's basically it could be you? like a <laughs> <laughs> Nah bro, I be catching people. They be trying to like uh they'll go and they'll steal like three black shirts. And then on the receipt it says like black shirt with this color accent or whatever, you know, uh-huh. type thing. But they'll have three shirts like that, but they stole two of them. And then they'll go try to return one so they, get extra money. So the one that they paid for, you know, got yeah. free, you know, then they also have an extra one. And I'm like, damn, these motherfuckers be returning shit that they never bought. Yeah. Nah, I broke my fucking beats. 
the studios, like the over the top mm-hmm. type for the gym and shit. Yeah. I snapped them, bro. I haven't even had them for over a year. I guess I got a big head. You were angry. <laughs> and we're back. I guess I got a big head. So, yeah, no, I was at the gym, dude. I was trying to hit my set. I was going to put it over the top, and then it just, I was like, what the fuck, dude? You're like, hell I yeah. Just, I just had one just <laughs> flopping, <laughs> dude. I was like, what the fuck? I just got these, dude. And me, I'm not a, I'm not a receipt keeper. I'm not a box keeper. I'm sure I have the box, yeah, but no, I'm a dude, box they don't, they don't want to return it. What? Yeah. I think Bro, like with shit like that, uh, you have to go through beats themselves. Like yeah. you gotta send them in. <laughs> Fuck. Like for me, or do what fucking Merlin yeah, did, bro. F- a- f- a f- fucking Merlin brought some shoes, and and then one was like wearing, like more than the other one. He he called them and they're like, yeah, we'll send you a pair, and they just send them a free pair of shoes. Oh, fuck, so I mean, all you gotta do is just call and dude, risk Merlin it. Gets you know, a lot of free shit too. I remember well, that look, one so time we got chocolate they're, cake. They're, they're big corporations. <laughs> <laughs> like n- you gotta think, not everybody's doing it, bro. So that's why they don't. They're, they're big corporations. They rather have you come buy some more. Yeah. Later on, than fucking miss over fucking ten cents. How much do you think it cost them ten cents, bro? In the, in their eyes, it's like ten fucking cents. Here you go. Fuck. Yeah, no. I've always been like that. Yeah, too, so to to fucking think about it, they're like, well, he's the first one that called us this week. Fuck it, we'll send them a pair of shoes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, you'd be like, hey, I've been, I had these for like just call like Monday morning, year. like nah, right when they open. If you keep your customers happy, they're gonna keep coming back. Yeah. So period. So what you saying is beats are done with you? No, I went fuck to Best beats. Buy. I'm done with Best Buy. Oh, fuck Best Buy. Yeah, fuck you, Best Buy. Unless you want to sponsor us. Fuck Geek Squad. Then, I then we nah, I know, I yeah, know some homies. Bro, they, they I go, should give them a use. They go, re- they return they go return shit at Best Buy, and then like when they start checking serial numbers, the homie starts getting scared, bro. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> is that you or what? Is he talking that happened about to you? me once. Where it feels attacked. Like, hey, I don't, don't like want to expose myself, but... <laughs> like, who knows who's gonna watch this? You know, it's like, hey, that is that motherfucker, bro. I feel like everyone does that. Watch me on talking to you. I mean, yeah, but now, like, it's in the works, obviously. But it's they're starting to like crack down on people returning shit because they're basically gonna expose them. Well, yeah, but at one point in time, it was like, uh, uh do you I return know, like, shit? Certain, well, certain, uh, sometimes, like when I need to. Is it if it's if it's something like a shirt? Are you are you gonna return it? Depends on how much the shirt costs, honestly, because I'm like... But if you spend, like, like 10 bucks on a shirt, and you're like, oh, it's my size, can you go home, it's and you're like, if it fits me too tight, or $10, you know what? If I put $10 in my gas tank, it doesn't even move the bar, bro. But if it's a uh, $25 shirt. Oh, well, shit, I need that the 50 you know, the, the fiber, <laughs> oh you know? I feel like I would just fucking just at be a like, certain, here, do you yeah, want it? Yeah, at a certain point, it's just like... Well, it's a dope ass shirt, but you know it's in Gabe size. Hey, do you want this shirt? I have this shirt. It's just that's, that's what happened to me. You know, I I, a, I, I I'd probably see you guys before I return it. Yeah. So I'm like, hey, you need a shirt? I got a shirt right there. I thought I, I bought a shirt, but I didn't read the. It said oversized T, but it was large. Mm-hmm. So then I put it on. And I was like, fuck, this thing's Gave huge. So I told Gabriel because I know he, he he likes wearing big he likes wearing baggy clothes. Yeah, dude. So sure. I told you you like wearing. So I told him I was like, "Hey, I have the shirt if you, you want it." And the pump. he gotta hide the pump. It fit me like a slim, slim like a, fit. Like, <laughs> <laughs> me slim. No, but it said like it's I I just wanted a plain white tee and I bought it, but it Why said plain like white tee oversized. Captain America, from this bitch. Yeah. <laughs> but. But yeah, I, I don't know. I was just like, I was like, fuck, dude. And then I was like, I'm not gonna return it because I, I fucking bought it online. So I was like, I want to see if this one wants it. I'm not a big fan of that buying stuff online, or especially for clothing. Me either, but I'm sometimes just fucking, you just got to. It's a hit or miss, I think. Honestly, no, I'm. I'm a you got bit, huh? You got what? a big ass bubble on your arm, dude. Where? You see that shit? Right there, you in the back. That, that's his TV shot, boo. <laughs> oh, is that your is that your Mexico shot or what? Tuberculosis. Oh shit! No, I did get bit. Damn, bro! Look, hey, in your backyard, hey, bro. Hey, I'm now getting for the, hit for the rest of the right night. He's gonna be itching that spot because he knows it's there now. <laughs> I was scratching here. I was like, dude, I know. Yeah, no, you know, I my grandma it. always told me. She told me like, uh, lick your thumb. Your saliva kind of like neuralizes the bugs. the itching. Speaking of bugs, bunny, bugs. You know what bugs me? You know what bugs me? Nah. Or grind your gears. Have you guys had a uh, reoccurring dreams? Yes. Have you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Have bugs. you had reoccurring dreams? Like you have the same dream or, sometimes, or yeah. like nightmares, I guess. Yeah, type thing. <clears throat> oh, right. yeah, one. It's gonna be good. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna be good. So I have a reoccurring one that's been happening pretty, pretty often. So I'll be like, 
see, but I can't even say if it's a dream or like I'm daydreaming because most of the time it's when I'm like I'm snoozing. It's a dream. Like when I'm like like oh, midway, like, yeah. like you're half awake, half asleep. When you're about to knock out. Yeah, it's like, like when you hit after you hit wake up from the first alarm, hit the snooze, go back to sleep and you're about to wake back up and no matter it's what. It's more like when I got off of work. And then I'm chilling on the couch for about ten minutes, and just then getting start, like a you know? like a quick shut out, you know. Yeah, just yeah, yeah. So that's normally when it happens. But uh, when I open my eyes to kind of like turn my head or something, or I'm looking up at the the ceiling, I get a I see a spider Coming webbing, down? stringing down <laughs> towards web. towards what? <laughs> Go ahead. Stringing down, about a drop on my face. And then you wake up and it's not there. No, I. It's there. I let him finish. Damn. To me, it's real. Oh, shit. But the thing is, is like, you know, when you dream, let's say you're dreaming about a crocodile more than likely. Oh, you were in a crocodile's habitat. No, this is happening in my house where I'm sleeping. So I'll wake up and I'll see it stringing down about to fall on my face. So I get up and I freak out and I'm patting myself down like, oh, shit, there's a spider or something. And I think I said on a previous podcast I don't like spiders, bro. Like dead ass, mm-hmm. I, I'm pretty sure I have a form of arachnophobia. 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 Yeah, yeah. So I hate that shit. <laughs> <clears throat> you can ask my family, dude, that they've seen me before wake up and freak out, and I'm just patting myself down like, what the, the fuck? Spider. Dude, where's that shit at? Like, where's it at? Yeah. And they're like, what? There's nothing. Like, what are you tripping about? Like, no, nah, I've seen it. There's a fucking... So that's been happening to me pretty often, and my family has all witnessed it. So I want to ask you guys if you guys ever had a reoccurring dream, and about do you guys about think a about anything? Yeah. But <laughs> or do you guys think it has a meaning when do you, you think, keep dreaming? Well, some, sometimes it has a meaning. So like, I'm pretty sure if you look it up, it'll be like, oh, spiders represent this in your I dream. I did. I have it right here. Oh, but I want you guys to. Do you your, think is that you, like one night you were sleeping and you because you know sometimes when you wake up but you knock out right away. Do you think that you don't remember seeing a spider, but you saw a spider and you just knocked out? See, and that's what I was and saying. And then now too. it's just implanted because you saw it, your brain saw it, but you're personally, you like, you didn't. So now it's just there, like your body's warning you, like, fuck, careful, there's a spider. Nah, because when I see a spider, I won't sleep. What if you got like, <laughs> I'll, I'll wake up and I'll What if you that previously shit? got bit by a spider without knowing, but it was like only half radioactive, so it's taking a while for it to get you Spider Man powers? I get bit every night, bro. So I wake up with a bite every day. <laughs> just a Rita. It's not an easy body to Like for real. With her only ear, two teeth. Yeah. But yeah, the dream I've been having since since I was little, it's always a. Uh, well, I thought there was a spider. No, <laughs> no. I just, thought there was a spider. In no, no, no. <laughs> it's it's um. I I'm I'm always going up a, a fucking huge, the biggest bridge in the world, just going up, and then right when I get to the like, I see it like I'm standing. I'm huh. far away, and, and I see the bridge, and I see cars coming up and down like normal, and I'm like, fuck, I'm scared. And next, you know, I'm like, I'm in the bridge, and I'm like, fuck. And then right when I get to the top, I wake up, and I'm sweating. That's been happening since I was, since I was little, and I don't know what the fuck that means. Is it like an every night thing, or is it just like every so often, but it's every, the same dream? Every once in a while, but it's, but the, it's same the same thing. Dream. And I wake, okay. always wake up sweating. And I've I've looked up, like, the biggest bridges and all that, and not one bridge I've, that That's I've familiar. seen looks like that. At so least not yet. That's why I'm saying, like, fuck, is that a... It's a vision, is that, bro. Is, is that a vision? Maybe you're supposed to make the world's biggest bridge. Honestly, I'm gonna be scared. I've, I've had dreams vision. that are that were visions before. That like what deja vu? My dream, nah, not deja vu. Like the, the dream was telling me something, something that I guess was thinking about, like in the fucking back of my mind, where I didn't want it to believe it true, but when I dream about it, I know it is. So eventually, if I it came up. The fucking thing came about, whatever, yada yada, and it was true. Elaborate. You got cheated on or something? And nah, then I in mean, your dream you got cheated on. It's more of a. Um, how can I say it? Basically, like, uh, just letting you know that whatever you were thinking about, whether it's fucking second guessing or overthinking, I think plays a part in that dream. So, you. What I'm asking is, uh, are you gonna elaborate on your dream? About what happened, or I can't think of it right now. <laughs> oh gosh! What about you, Worm? Uh, honestly, I find myself having deja vu a lot. I have had like reoccurring dreams, but I mean, reoccurring dreams, reoccurring dreams. Take a shot. All right. Uh, <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. He said that's the energy we need. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'll take a shot right after. Uh, yeah. So I've had reoccurring dreams and. 
everybody laughs at me like, oh, everybody has those dreams. It's the same motherfucking dream, though. Like, it's me having a shit ton of money. Like, if I won the lottery and kind of like what I would do. And, like, I see numbers everywhere. <sighs> but when I wake up, I only remember, like, part of the number. Like, I remember, like, oh. Write them all down. Like, let's say it was, like, 35 or whatever. And it was, like, the five was hit by the spotlight. So I only see three kind of thing. But I could tell there's another number behind there. Like, I could see the edge of the five. But I don't know if it's a five or, or I can see the edge of a, a nine. And I think it's, like, a four or something. You know, like, type thing. Yeah. So, but it's just, like, that's my reoccurring dream. But I've had deja vu, like, even before I met you, you know, like, people would be, like, I see this person or, like, this kind of, like, figure, and it's, like, really resemblance. Like, I could, f- like, see, like, a big resemblance. So you're and saying you've dreamt of me before prior to meeting me? Is that where you're getting at? <laughs> well, like, yeah, like, you, <laughs> Diego, or you guys saying some shit. Or us doing some shit, and I could uh. just, I know, like, let's say I'm about to, I'm at the fair, or I'm at the bar about to hit this punching bag, and I can see, like, four figures behind me, you know, and I take a quick glance, and I, like, and then somebody says, oh, you're going to be a bitch hit, you know? And I'm like, somebody fucking said that before. Like, I remember that shit already, you know? <laughs> like, you know, it's just like, it's, it's not necessarily what you're doing, uh-huh. but it's just like the words that... Like, come out, like, that conversation you feel like you've had before. And you know that you never had that conversation because it's fucking 4 a.m. And you guys are both fucking sober as hell eating carne asada for some reason. You're like, what the fuck? All right. So. What is the rack? What does your spider mean in your dream? Yeah. Scooter man. So, like, my whole family has seen me wake up like this, freaking out, right? Yeah. So, uh. My mom, being the Mexican that she is, Cucuy. she got it uh, interpreted for me. So this is what it says. Buy a frijolera? Yeah, I got to fucking crack an egg under my bed or however the fuck it goes. Yeah. I might be cursed, dead ass. I'm that, cursed. That's probably witchcraft. You I need a, uh, right there. probably a witch who fucking... Oh, you need a cleanse. Yeah, dude. I need a fucking... But why would, I want to, why would a witch go after you? I need fucking aloe vera. Oh, man. Shit, <laughs> There's a bunch of reasons, huh? <clears throat> okay, spiders hanging from the ceiling. Premonition of some spiritual transition. <laughs> you need to acknowledge the past. Recognize those former relations that have brought you to where you are today. You are seeking clarity in a situation. I feel like those, that's... Those dreams denote something that you are trying to process and digest. You are harboring some guilt. A spider in your dream refers to some major setbacks, obstacles in achieving your goals. You view a situation, you need to view your situation at a mm-hmm. different perspective. You need to control your temper. And this dream is some sort of divinity. <laughs> you need to be more in touch with your femininity. Yikes. Yeah, <laughs> fucking right, Estrogen. pussies. Estrogen. It was that fucking beard, see? <laughs> see, you guys you guys hey, fucking so cursed me. Wait, wait, quick question. How long ago this, did this dream like start reoccurring? Uh, uh, fuck you guys. <laughs> How long ago? How long ago? Like a week? No, 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 no. Months? Last year? No, nah, when I started having this dream was about two years ago. Oh. Fucking, that's when like you met me. There you me, go, dude. Dog. That's your answer right there. You dropped me, big dog. Are, are you done with it? Is this more to say? Uh, what? It says your dream is about your overly competitive and aggressive nature. Am I aggressive? Sky Yo, what the bro. fuck, dude? I'm Spider? getting bitten by spiders, spiders? left and right here. Dude. <laughs> spiders? Look at this shit, bro. Oh, my God. <laughs> Go like this. Go like this. Go like this. Well, it wasn't the right spider. I guess. Da, da. <laughs> da, da. Yeah, just the basic. It symbolizes fear, anxiety, I got that I'm looking for it. acceptance. And <laughs> I guess going yeah. back, going back to mine, like oh, envisioning. I mean, fucking, the bitch wasn't wrong. <laughs> envisioning <laughs> fucking, wrong. you know, my dreams, whatever. That makes a lot more sense. Well, when you read that, I was like, do you dream about actually, spiders too? Nah, not spiders, but certain people. Oh well, then how do how does that? that that's for only spiders, though, bro. Oh my gosh! <laughs> He's gonna talk about spiders in your dreams. <laughs> no, no some- but that thing that it said about um about like past relationships and all that. 
yes. stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm listening. Saying, like, I mean, sometimes there's no fucking clarity, and that's what everyone wants. Could you get? <clears throat> could you get closure? Your past relationships? Nope. There it is. Yeah, but I don't. I don't need that. Do yeah, I? you do. Why do I need it? It's mind over matter, big dog. Right now, you don't need it. In the back of your head. Your body, your soul, your brain, and you—you can feel like your body's past it, but your mind's yeah. not. Damn, bro! I, I feel like once you get that it's clarity, mind over matter, or once you like at least attempt to get a clarity, and you know it's not gonna happen, then, then it's like, it's like when like, for example, like like someone dies and they're and they're like haunting someone. Mm-hmm. Once they fix that issue, then then the ghost can finally rest. <laughs> but like that's what's happening. Like, like your body, your soul, whatever is not. It can't rest because it doesn't have that clarity. So you're saying you want me to go back and and and. I'm just saying mm-hmm. if if you well you said that you didn't get clarity so I mean some maybe you need clarity. It wouldn't hurt. But mind never <sighs> matter. So your body might be past it, but your mind's not. Yeah. It, it's the it's the same principle as your your mind knows or what they said it's like like ten supercomputers or something put together. No, you're, you're, I just have my brain. That's it. Yeah, my, hey, you know your tongue like knows knows what everything like feels like. Pause. Huh? Like if you were to look at something and think like, how would it feel like on your tongue? Your tongue huh? knows. Hey yo, pause. pause. Why are you looking at? Is, why are you looking at? What are you at trying Diego? to get at? Why are you looking at Diego, big dog? <laughs> where was that? You know, if, no, because it's mind over something? it's mind over matter. Your mind, your mind could work at a thousand. Beats per minute, but if your body's working so on a hundred, so you're saying I'm looking at a burger, bro. I'm about to minute? eat a chocolate bar. I'm gonna taste the burger. No, what? I thought you said mind over matter. Yo, my homies are stupid. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I'm not stupid. You have, you never seen those people like smelling a the burger? They need you broccoli. That's that's what I mean. No, that what he's talking about is different. I'm different. Oh, no, I'm different. I'm I get different. what you mean because because that, that that does it kind of works. It doesn't hundred percent work. Mm-hmm. But, but it but it does it. work. You've done it. No, because uh, I've because if you if you eat something too spicy, too sour, it's it's not gonna work. <laughs> Look at you tasting your tongue, Mickles. No, what I what I <laughs> what I'm saying is, bro, you might feel like you're past it, like your heart. Yeah, but you're feels not. like you're past it, but your mind's still gonna think about it. Edit the AOL dial up noise right now. It's on me. Just, <laughs> just, just loading. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I don't know. I gotta reboot my computer. Yeah, I feel. Okay. I feel like everyone should go for that closure, even though it's Definitely. been so long. Nah. I think we all need therapy. That's what that, that that's what uh um people Next that are in, in uh, everybody's getting therapy. That's what people in <laughs> fucking going through fucking PTSD like rehab do, right? Oh. There's steps to the rehab and and they're like a step is going back and like mending all your. Like burn bridges, like not making it cool, but just telling them, like you know what, it was my fault. I fucked up. Or even if it wasn't your fault, I yeah. Or you know, just just know that I I I had time to think about it, and (sighs) it is what it is. I'm not here for attention from you. I'm not here to talk to you ever again. I'm just telling you that for like for for my sake and maybe yours, you know, I'm sorry or whatever. And Sometimes even you if you don't go, and if it comes back to you, yeah, it's meant to me. No, I'm just saying. Like, I, I, I think it's good for everyone to, yeah, to get that. I clarity, mean, I, I get guess. where you're coming from too, <laughs> but uh, from? from your tip, <laughs> pause. No, nah, I could just tell by the look on your face. Well, you, you're, you're still on that. Like, nah, fuck that. I'm not doing that. He has names right now. You're, yeah, but, yeah, but, no, but, for but sure. You, because to me, to, to me, that, that is a form of closure. Like the way it ends is like that's your closure. No, that's how if it's if to they be. didn't talk or, or express things, it's like okay, don't do it now. Because like you said, I'm the type now. of person don't do it now. That's gonna say, all right, you don't want to tell me or right, you don't cool. want to come kick it. Hey, that's I feel cool. like that's how you are now. Well, so like me, I'm the you're person you're talking like, about now. I'm the person. Fuck like, you, Diego. You're well, not my uh, therapist, dude. <laughs> no, it's just like cause so in my in my eyes, I'm the person that if I have like a song in my head. I'm not going to fucking stop until I find out what that song is. You, you're like, what's that song? Fuck it. I can't remember. Next. Damn. <laughs> you know? Nah, no, no. So, it's true. So it's like, it's up to you, though. But your mind is telling you you're not forgetting about the song. But my body. But your body's body telling you, hey, you, you know what? Well, I mean, everyone has different forms of closure. Yeah. Well, yeah, but what I'm what I'm saying is, 
Whether we might have different forms of closure, but whether you think you're closed or not, your not, mind's yeah. telling you you're not. Yeah, because like how we said, like, oh, but I think your closure is. Nah, that's what you think. If you now. had closure, you wouldn't have the dream. Yeah. So that mm-hmm. spider is that dirty bitch. Dude, there that was thing. a lot in that shit, though, because there is things, like I said, um, I'm pretty hard on myself. I think some of us naturally are, right? I think it's it's it is good to be hard on yourself. Pause. I think I, it is a Why does everybody fucking do that? I hate that pause bullshit, bro. I don't know. Well, because we got to take a moment to assess what we just said. Pause. <laughs> now we're back. Did you th- <laughs> like just think about it's it? Like, yeah, bro. I like them big. Pause. <laughs> what do you like big? Dick. Pause. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> Go on. Go. Spotted no, dick. You guys are fucking extra with it, though. It's just like you guys are making shit that you're reaching for it to be gay nah. to, in order oh. to say pause. Pause. <laughs> pause. That was gay. <laughs> what was I but saying, you, though? Something about that there's a lot, there's lot in there in your there's phone. A so, there's a lot of closure you need in your like phone. Like I said, like just there's a lot of things that I want to do that I know I'm not doing. And I know I could be pushing harder in a in a bunch of ways in my life, and I think I like it said. I think I do hold a lot of guilt because I know these are things you care about. These are things that I, you want to improve on. Mm-hmm. My dad just cussed <laughs> out my dog or what? <laughs> he opened it. He said, "Get in." She looked up at him. Didn't want to go in, and he was like, "Get in." She was like, "Fuck you, then." <laughs> Slam the door. <laughs> and now she wants to go in. Look at her. <laughs> Well, I think yeah. it's it's good to be hard on yourself, but you can. I I feel like you probably overdo it. Yeah, I do for sure. I think that goes on another thing I want to talk about, which is I would call it the on and off switch or whatever. So the way I see it is like you know we all have our daily routines, you know, fucking doing this or not throughout the week, whatever. For me, I feel like it's always an ongoing thing, though. I could never relax, relax like fully relax, because there's always something to fucking do. Like, and fuck, I have to wake up. Fuck, I have yeah, to eat. You know? I got to shower. Like, for an, like, earlier today, I knew I had to do all this shit and, like, handle it or whatever, but. You it did was, it. No, <laughs> no, you no, do no, no I chill, did. But I did, eventually. but, like, I was always, like, I think I overdo it to where, like, I'm overthinking. I was like, damn, like, I have to go do this, blah, blah, and I, I think I overwhelm myself. Do you think that's more or less not an on or off switch? That's more of a procrastination switch? Mm, I think it depends. Not really, no, because I'm always doing something. You know, I always but have something what, to but, do. But what you were doing was it uh, proactive on what you were trying to accomplish? Yeah, for the day? I mean, okay. yeah, I have to fucking you know do my daily routine, take I a shower, and shit like that. And fucking nah. But uh, yeah. What do you guys think about that? You do you guys think like you guys are always like on the move, nonstop? Always. I don't. Non-stop. Uh, it feels what? like you're always yeah. doing something. I'm always. Yeah, I wasn't going to say that. I was going to say I have my own type of on and off switch. I mean, I think we've talked about it before, too, right? Like you said, prior to my traumatic past or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> prior to a fucking yeah. <laughs> spider dropping yeah, from the ceiling. Yeah, prior to all that toxicity that entered my life. The toxicity. I was a very emotional, empathetic kind of guy, right? And now, dude. It's Tone Cold Steve Austin. Bro, I flipped the switch. <laughs> And, and it, dude, it, it has not. <laughs> and I think Diego called me out. My brothers called me out. Like, dude, we told you to improve this, but now, like, now you're just now overdoing you're just, it. Now you just a uh, gangsta killer, dude. Because because I I I, I, I I I remember telling him, dude, like, just stop caring. He's like, how? And then oh. he just doesn't give a fuck. And I'm like, dude, that didn't mean no, like, hey, hey, like, bro, chill. Like you know he didn't say it like that. He said no. it like over, over a beer. No, nah, he how did because because I remember one time he was telling me he's like, dude, how do you like how does it not bug you? And I'm like, it just doesn't. Just I just don't care about it. And he's just like, it's like how do you like? What do you mean you don't care about it? I'm like, I just just don't. Yeah, and it's good not to care, but it's like I you suck. you have to not care, but also <laughs> care. No, I I I feel like you gotta not care, but also put yourself in like if you're talking to someone, you don't care what they think, but. You gotta put yourself on their shoes and be like, "Yeah, I still don't care, but like, I, but I'm gonna see how how you see it. I don't care still, but I'm gonna just see it and then I'm like, okay, I be like, I, I, I I get now. <laughs> be like, Gabriel, my my whole family just died, dude. I'm uh, I'm going through it right now. He's like, oh man, uh, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
that had Dan Brown. Oh, Seattle. Hey, hey, uh, what He's size like, shoe oh, are you? Yeah, to take off your shoe. Yeah. Ah, uh, this don't fit. <laughs> Not gonna work. I can't. <laughs> I can't relate, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't know, bro. Uh, yeah. Uh, so that's my on and off switch. Uh, I mean, it's well, either that, that's it's either your off on switch. or off, bro. There's there's no. I can't. I can't control it. There's no in between. Yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah. That for just for me. What about you, Diego? I think Diego's got it down. That's me personally just thinking. I think like, he, let's say I think he is just there playing with the fucking lights. Just, just, just <laughs> fucking around? <laughs> yeah, like, who do I want to be today? <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, you had a long day, uh, like, work week, whatever. Like, when it comes to your weekend, like, you know, like, you can just chill. Like, your body knows that and, like, with your mind is like, like, oh, like, I'm chilling. Or it's always like, damn, I still got to do this, 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 and this. Nah, it knows because it's like... Well, for me, like the weekend, I don't like. Basically, what what the fuck? Did you turn my mic off? No, it's right here. It's same level, weirdo. What the fuck? It sounds. Do I sound weird? No, no you better. Sound, oh, you sound so sound weird. hot. There, not <laughs> pause. <laughs> oh shit, pause. <laughs> no, nah, but yeah, I don't know. It's just because um, because while the whole week I'm just like grinding, like st- like come Monday. Monday. <laughs> I I just I just I just I just get it in my head like oh, okay I'm gonna work and I'm gonna work go home sleep eat work and I just have that through the through the whole day and I I try not to to like be like fuck I'm tired like oh fuck I got work tomorrow I just I just try to keep it like steady uh-huh. so when so when the weekend comes I'm just like okay a- a- anything I do these two days like it's all just chilling like because. Cause, cause my brain's so used to just all right, just work, work, work. So now, when it comes like the weekend, I'm just like, all right, well, this is obviously not what I'm doing the week, so I can just, just chill. Even though I'm I'm out or at a party, mm-hmm. or I gotta take care of my kids and shit like that. Like I, I just know like this is all. At least, at least I'm not working, so that's my way of relaxing. So more, the light, so the light switch is in the, the middle. Just no. Uh, when he has a dimmable light switch, big dog. <laughs> oh, Monday shit. through Friday, Monday through Friday, it, it's on. on a smart app. Okay, okay. That that minute I clock off work Friday night, it's just off, and and I don't care who calls me from work. I'm not I'm not flipping it on for no one. Yeah, that's really. It. So more of the story is we're all depressed. Uh, if you guys are depressed like us, <laughs> go ahead. Yeah. Life right. sucks. <laughs> Life sucks. I mean, for me, it's like I wouldn't necessarily well because I'm. I'm always on. Well, you're. I, I feel like your schedule kind of my schedule inflicts. So no, well, I mean, like, like, like sometimes I, I'm working during the weekend, but some people just don't get that. Like, hey, mm-hmm. like I gotta work a lot, but when I'm off, they're like, oh, you're always sleeping. I'm not always sleeping. When you hit me up, I'm sleeping. <laughs> That's my fucking time to sleep. You know, but. I have an on and off switch. Like I have a party mode and like, hey, I gotta get up and get to work mode type t- type of thing as well. You know, or, like or a chill mode. Like well, do throughout the week. So this past like week, Getting I've been as soon as I get home, you me rub it. Like I have, <laughs> I've had, I've had a day this week. So this week I've worked three days, right? Oh well, four days including today. Mm-hmm. So one day I only had a uh, an hour and a half break in between. But as soon as I got off one job, I went and turned my, like, a, at least hit the weights for 30 minutes and then go to work, you know? Like, I've, I've had an on and off switch, but sometimes what you think is on is my off. No, I mean, I don't think that. It's just, no, it's but, you, no, no, no. Bro. Well, <laughs> Damn, bro, my bad not shit. You, not you personally. I'm just saying, like, it just in general, like, what you're – off might be somebody's on like oh well they, you know what i'm chillaxing but i'm gonna go out with friends today and go do what i want to do oh that's on because that's draining your energy and that's this, this and that you know like but that's yeah, your off some you know? people gain energy from that shit yeah you know but it's just yeah. not me i can't relate to the people who get energy like i'm yeah, tired right you, now well you're acquired taste yeah but I'm anyways, acquired taste. <laughs> Come like my pause my off Switch is probably more active than a lot of people's on. See, my goal is to not have a switch. I just want to be on the move. So we had this whole fucking conversation for nothing, bitch. You, you want to be a strobe dude. light, huh? <laughs> 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 oh, man. 
Fuck. No. So you're going to take that shot or what? I don't think yeah, we yeah, did. Sh- did you? I did. did he? He did. I did. What's I up did. with you, dude? You hit legs I'm today or what? A cramp over here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you just got to turn off the off switch on that, bro. Just don't think Chip. about it, dude. It's all mental. <laughs> Mind over matter. Fuck, dude. There was something I wanted to say amongst this conversation. Who is uh, she? All this depth. Who is she? All right, we're hearing. What? Go Who's, for it. There's no one. Bro, get off of me. I'm getting Sp- up cramping and getting bit. Spiders? Yeah, you have a lot of spiders back here, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's a dream, bro. <laughs> yeah, that shit real, huh? <laughs> and that's what, see, and that's what I was telling myself. Like, the next time like, you see that shit. You ate. Right, like what? you, you know, like you eat like a lot, like see, not me like, though, like seven thousand spiders, like in your lifetime, no, or something like that. Nah, it's one every year, fool. You eat, yeah. Spider goes in your mouth while you're sleeping at least once a year. Damn, oh, you that's... had like no. twenty eight spiders. No, nah. is, nah. is it a male or a female yeah. spider? Yeah. Not me. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> that dreams, those dreams that I be having, bro. He says, I just <laughs> take my mouth closed since I was five. Yeah, I, I fucking, five. I feel that shit, dude. Those I are hear spiders. Yeah, I fucking hear them. You, ever, you, you guys ever had those dreams where like big booty spiders whatever like you're in, interacting with someone or encounter something and when you wake up you feel that like if somebody fucking scratched you in so the dream somebody fucked you and then you felt that yeah and you woke up and you're like damn <laughs> <laughs> so sore what happened wait what well, damn damn what what happened finish no, um, get to the climax what, what happened dude pause <laughs> You said, have you ever felt no, that? Um, <laughs> I remember in one dream. No, I was not effed. Um, oh. I remember in one dream. Um, I forgot what was happening, but I fucking, I got like, I got touched. I got like scratch. Pause. You had touched. <laughs> I got scratched. Where and on then, the bottle did he touch you? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, it's terrible. And but yeah, when I woke the, up, I, bruise or something? I felt that. Yeah, I was like, what the fuck? And I looked and I was like, dude, I feel it right, like right here. Mine over matter. Nah, but I mean, that's... That's your mind thinking it's there. I feel like that happened before. Well, you know? yeah, that goes for, like, pain, too, and all that. Well, I had a dream. I was in a car accident, and my fucking leg hurt for two days. Don't know <laughs> fucking oh, shit. <laughs> I swear that, was, that was a coma. <laughs> this dude broke his arm in his <laughs> sleep, bro. <laughs> he was like this, and he twisted. He like, yeah. <laughs> he woke up like, damn, that accident. <laughs> accident. <laughs> 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 Bruh. You good, or are you itchy now? No, my cramp, it's there, but it's not bad, but I'm just itchy. You guys believe in lies will catch up to you? Yeah. That's what I was going to say. You're a liar? No, no, no. I was going to say, like, things catching up to you. Your past. Yeah, yeah. So things catching up to you. Ah, bro, this is going to sound depressing, but I feel like I got everything I deserved. Uh, Based on your actions? Yes, definitely. I do firmly believe that, like, Things that happened in my life, yeah, obviously they're on me, and I'm not happy with all the choices I made in my life and mm-hmm. the way I went about shit. Yeah. That I know I've hurt some people out there. So it's like, yeah. But you've been hurt too. Yeah. So, I mean, so yeah, you, but you, I mean. You, you got what you deserved, and you feel like you paid for your actions. Why are you having this fucking stupid ass dream? I don't know. I'm going to keep my eyes open. <laughs> And, so I, and so not gonna freak sleep? out. And yeah, I'm, dude, I'm not going to freak out, dude. I'm not going to wake up and, helps. and pat myself. I'm going to fucking try to face it head on and watch this shit be real. You get bit? Watch this shit be real. <laughs> He's in the chat like, hey, bro, I'm in the hospital. Yeah, dude. I got bit by your next, mama. Next fucking podcast, dude, watch. A uh, fucking, uh, fucking brown Fat recluse bit me. Dude. Swollen. I lost now, my arm. Now, like. It's not even going to be that. It's just going to be his dad in the hallway. Like, hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's just fucking around. Hey guys, so it turns out it was a real spider after all. <laughs> like, I guess hey. it wasn't a dream. <laughs> I guess this, this fucking hey, spider's dad's been, been here. playing this two year long prank with a fake spider. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be crazy. Imagine, like, like you have a big spider just fucking no, living in your house. I, I, I've had a oh, lot caught up to me. <laughs> hey, I've had a lot caught up to me. Like, oh, I hurt my shoulder. And then one day I actually hurt my shoulder, and they're like, Sounds like the same shoulder injury, and you just got caught Man, up. Or happened something. twice. So then they're like, "We need a doctor's note." So I give them a doctor's note, and then they're like, mm, "We don't really believe you." And then I went and work popping my shoulder because my shoulder pops in and out now, on its own. Mm-hmm. So like, if I go like this, pop, it'll pop in and out, and it's fucking crazy because it caught it back up to me. So, so you guys believe no, and like, 
whatever action you did, eventually it'll catch up to you. Is that, is that what you're trying yeah. to get at? Yeah. So, like, if you're doing fucking, like, a bunch of good deeds or whatever, you think that eventually, would eventually yeah. catch up to you? Yeah, but if, if you don't just, do it. That's kind of a... But if, look, 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 look. But, so it takes but you can't though. do it thinking, like, oh, next year, since I'm doing all this good shit, it's going to catch up to me. Nah, look, so, so, it don't work like that. So think about nah, it like I mean, think about it like but you're, you're, you're on the freeway. That, though. Freeway. You can't freeway. Freeway. I'm not thinking Traffic stopped. I'm stupid. Freeway. Traffic stopped. Now, <laughs> your bad action is going to be able to go ahead on the side and then merge in somewhere else. Uh, but your good action staying there. Eventually, thought. you're going to get to where you need to go. But your bad action is going to get you there faster. And a ticket. But you're going to get a ticket or whatever else is going to happen bad to you. You're going to be like, I wish I just didn't do that. But your good action would eventually get there. So your good action is always going to be slower than your bad action. You'll see Reaper. No, whatever That's action. That's a shot. My, my mom always told me whatever action Mama. that you ever had, uh. it's gonna have repercussions, whether they're good or they're bad. They're gonna be repercussions. Okay, look, perfect example right now. My, I wore shorts, right? Okay. <laughs> and now I'm, I'm facing the consequences, bro. I'm getting eaten up over here. You're getting Pause. eaten out. <laughs> yeah. God damn. No. Pause. So my action. I was like, hey, I mean, I'm going to wear shorts. Sometimes there's things that happen in life, whatever, where I don't see it as a bad thing or a good thing, though. Like, okay, for instance, I'll give you an example. Fucking, you're walking along the street, whatever, and you fucking found a briefcase of a million dollars on the fucking thing. street. That's a good thing. That's, that's, a, good that's a good thing. thing. <laughs> that's a blessing. <laughs> that's, that's a blessing. You don't know that. Why Why you somebody want? lost that. Who the fuck loses a million dollars in a suitcase, bro? <laughs> I'm always looking for that shit. Dumbass, right now. I'm always looking for that shit. <laughs> Quick question: Would you take it though? Pause. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Quick question: Can you take it though? I would. <laughs> I can. I'll take it in a heartbeat. Pause. Oh, God damn. <laughs> no, I would. Yeah, I would. There come in. There's so many ways to get that money clean. Okay, so. let's say if somebody <laughs> dropped it though, or whatever. If I saw someone drop it, yeah. like, hey, bro, yo. You you you'll give it back to them. Yeah, but like, hey man, you, if if it opened up, I'd be like, hey, but you gotta break me off something. <laughs> break me off a piece. You gotta break man. me off a Milly chunk. Bar. Nah, yeah, I would be like, hey, bro, you, why the fuck are you walking around with a million dollars, you stupid ass? <laughs> be like, you're lucky I'm not someone else. I would have fucking nah. Like I mean, sometimes you just gotta you be off. a thug, have a backbone. You'd be like, hey, here's your million dollars. It it was a milli. But now it's like nine hundred and ninety thousand. See, that's a bad deal. It's gonna catch uh, up. To you. So you want to steal from people? No, you're just like, hey, I took what I took, so you didn't lose it all. <laughs> so you, so, so you stole. It's a finder's fee, bitch. Fuck you. So you stole. <laughs> it's not stealing. I could have kept the whole motherfucking thing, but I was a good person. I don't know. You guys are kind of inspiring me to steal. No, nah, to like <laughs> kind of repent your sins and and, and kind of go back and tell the people. Well. Go back and on episode twenty three, tell us what happened. Hold on, I'll tell you. I'll tell you right now. <laughs> Get the fuck off my phone! Nah. <laughs> nah. What? I was about to put you up. I was about to put you up. Damn. Uh, we should do it where you where you call them, and then we'll we'll sync you on the fuck thing. Fuck no, dude. And then but we'll see, just meet no. ourselves. I oh, never mind. I'll, we'll talk about it later. <laughs> this needs to be off podcast because I feel emotional right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that has been episode twenty two. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys. Please, 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 please. Comment. Say something, bro. Subscribe. Uh, give us ideas. Give us topics. Tell me what you think my dream means. Donate Tell spiders. Do donate nah, spiders nah, to Gabriel. Any kind. Nah, 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 we'll shit. set up a peel. I'll, I'll set up a uh, Gabriel's uh, address. What is your guys' impression of me? If you said that worm is coming to a party. What? We what talked about that already. No, I'm saying. Like, oh, oh, I was about to say. No, what I'm the telling fuck? them to comment that you weirdo. I thought you you want to <laughs> hype you up again, <laughs> starting over again. I think I still love them. Anyways, oh my god! Hey, <laughs> goodbye, so guys. Right. Episode twenty-two, <laughs> and uh, we're out. <laughs>